Hey guys, what's going on? So I finally had a brief minute to film a short video on the needlefish. Um, I've been trying to get to this for a while, just been super busy with orders. Uh, you know, the fall run came, then Christmas orders. So anyway, uh, what I want to touch base on is just, you know, uh, my two needlefish that I offer, the three ounce and the two ounce. Um, a few key points on them. First of all, um, they're loaded. So when you usually purchase, you know, some needlefish, a lot of guys load the needlefish, which puts all the weight to the back of the needlefish, which makes them cast really, really far. That's great, but it doesn't really help you with action that you really want. Um, you want something more balanced that's weighted throughout the whole entire body so you can impart the action that you want. If you want it to come up to the surface, you can by raising the rod. When all the weight is in the back of the needlefish, it wants to come up to the surface. In that case, just use a pencil popper, okay? Um, another thing too, there's a lot of different uses for needlefish, okay? Guys use them for, uh, you know, jig them. You can jig them off the bottom. You know, my how I like to use them is a steady retrieve. Keep the rod low, steady retrieve. A couple twitches here and there, get the nose moving a little bit. But basically, you know, they're very, they're like a stick in the water. But they're extremely effective, and I mean, a lot of guys swear by them. I don't use them as much as some other guys, so I'm not an expert. Uh, but I can tell you, based on my experience, um, you know how I use them, and I, you know, do pretty well with them. So, uh, yeah, I mean, just like a bucktail, a bucktail is extremely versatile. Why? Because it can use be used throughout the whole entire water column, from up high to down low. Uh, two colors right here, just, you know, random colors, the, you know, the simple natural needlefish and the new one that I just painted up, the new sand deal, which I really like that green. Um, been mixing a lot of colors to get that, that color green because they really, you can't buy that color green in airbrush paint, but, um, so you got to mix it. So I try to get it close every single time, but ultimately, yeah, I mean, they cast a mile, uh, basically, I mean, if you break in fish way way out get a needlefish on i don't care if it's daytime if you can get there with a pencil that's great too if they're feeding you know but if you know the way out you know definitely go for a needle and you can bring it up to the surface by just bringing the rod tip high um so yeah basically guys i just wanted to cover this you know brief video on needlefish and how mine are a little bit different you know like i said weighted throughout uh as opposed to weighted in the back i know some guys do weight theirs throughout also and that's great because that's what you want. You know, if if you're not going to buy mine, I definitely recommend buying one that's weighted throughout the whole entire needle. I mean, obviously, it's hard to know that by, you know, by the builder, but I can tell you that mine are. Um, so, the, you know, completely made of resin, rock solid, three coats of epoxy, and again, balanced. So, come with the best hardware on the market, like all my plugs, VMC, Wolverine um, splits. So, and again, uh, real, real quick too, I want to touch base on when to really use them. Primarily guys use them at night. They've been deadly at night. When the sun goes down, boom, needlefish, needlefish, needlefish. I've had them <laughs> fish until 10, 11 o'clock in the morning when the bite's hot. Is it because the bite's hot that they're hitting them? Yeah, it could be. But also I know a lot of guys that use them in the daytime and have, you know, a lot of success. So uh, but primarily, they have been a, a good night type of lure. Um, as far as colors, now I like natural colors, um, bright colors at times uh, for certain lures. Mainly, if you're fishing at night, you want the darker colors because it just they see shades anyway. Under a full moon, you may get away with like a yellow or like a dark black, a really really black. So, I mean, it, again, it's all preference of what you really, really want. And that's the beauty of getting painted any color you want. I'm confident in a few colors. You guys are confident in different colors. So, again, uh, you know, let me know what you guys need. Any questions you have on Needlefish or any plug that I make, uh, I'm happy to answer. Just send me an email, uh, Facebook message. You can get to me on Instagram uh, or even call me or text me. Uh, if I don't answer my phone, I'm probably epoxy in or just leave me a message and I'll, I'll be happy to answer any questions you guys have on on the needlefish and uh, or anything else you guys got all right guys well happy fishing uh orders are heading out extremely quick i'm actually 
sending out two orders per week. Uh, I'm trying to double up a little bit, which is really good. Been grinding for you guys. Uh, as you can see, <laughs> lots and <laughs> lots of plugs. Okay, so those are weeks and weeks right there. So I try to stay ahead, have them pre-built, but it does take time for the sanding, the epoxy, the painting. Everything takes time and, and drying time. So I hope you guys understand that. Uh, but right now it's right around 10 days I'm turning around in order, start to finish roughly almost 100 plugs. So, all right, guys, happy fishing. Let's uh, pray for good weather and spring to come fast. All right.